Hey, what is going on, YouTube fam? This is Tanmay Sakpal, and this is a quick short video about the DJI Mic 2. Now, for those who are subscribers on this channel or following this channel for a while, you guys know that I recently got the latest DJI Mic 2 wireless microphone system. And this is a quick short video about it. We did an unboxing and initial impressions video. So if you have missed that, do check it out. By the way, if you are new on this channel, my name is Tanmay Sakpal. I make content around consumer gadgets, content creation tools like smartphones, cameras, gimbals, microphones, etc. So if you are interested in such content, definitely check out this channel and do subscribe. I'm sure you'll find some value on this channel. Alright, coming back to these DJI Mic 2 microphone system, I have the receiver and the mic that is the transmitter in my hand. So the topic of this video is the newer firmware updates that are available for these mics. These are just launched a few days ago in this last month itself and we already have some new firmware upgrades and I saw some reviewers updating the new firmware and claiming that the audio quality has improved. Obviously the, the full review on these microphones is in the works. It's gonna take a while because there is a lot of testing, a lot of things to talk about these mics in detail. So the full review is gonna be coming soon. But in this video quickly what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to upgrade the firmware on the receiver as well as the transmitter just to show you guys in case if you own this DJI mic 2 you just have to scroll to the settings to do that just swipe up from the top and scroll to the last part which says general settings you can see just click on that and you just have to go to the version so you can see the version over here just click on it and you can see the firmware version currently it says 4.02.01.13 so this is the firmware for the receiver and for the transmitter that is the actual microphone this is the version basically i'm talking about this transmitter over here the version is 4.02.01.13 okay so we have a newer version for both the receiver and the transmitter so just to show you let's go to my computer screen all you have to do is go on this link provided by dji it's the official link of the dji mic 2 and just go into the download section so when you come into the download section or just click on this link i'll share this link in the video description if you scroll down you guys can see the firmware section for the receiver we have a newer firmware so on our screen or on our particular unit the firmware is as i said 4.02.01.13 but the new firmware is v04 that is 4.03 not 02 so this is a newer version for the receiver similarly this is a newer version for the transmitter and we also have one more pdf file over here you can see it's a pdf file which basically just gives some basic instructions on how to update this firmware so let's first check out this pdf so here you go it's a small pdf with basic instructions on you know where this new firmware is available how to upgrade it at a time so let's follow these steps and apply them onto our device so step one says download the firmware from this product page basically the downloads let's download these two individual files these are essentially bin files you can see so the update package is basically dot bin file all you have to do is first download the firmware let's download these two firmwares okay so as you can see i have downloaded these two firmwares one is the rx which is for the receiver tx is for the transmitter what is the next step the next step is basically connect transmitter or receiver to the computer using the usb c cable provided and when connecting to the computer the receiver needs to be in the off state and the transmitter can be either in the on or off state so let's first switch off the receiver because it needs to be in the off state i'm just gonna switch it off all right so i've switched it off we'll connect it via usb c i have this usb c cable over here ready to go i will just connect it in the back side of the receiver so i've connected it and uh, you can probably see a charging symbol but the receiver is basically turned off okay i've just connected it via usb c cable okay and now what we have to do is simply place the downloaded firmware update package bin file under the root directory of the transmitter or the receiver right now we've connected the receiver so hopefully we should see a folder for receiver you can see no name let me just go to that it's no name because i still have to name it but all i have to do is just 
take this receiver file and transfer it into the root directory of this no name it took a few seconds you know for the file to be transferred onto this transmitter even though the file was just a few mbs i don't know why maybe my computer just got hanged or something i don't know but yeah this receiver is taking a few seconds now to update now the same procedure has to be done for the transmitter also but let's first see if this updates properly it's taking quite a while i mean it's probably a minute now more than a minute i guess all right it's taken quite a lot of time i'll just you know keep this to the side while it updates and now let's move to the transmitter as well so according to the instructions the transmitter can be either on or off so i'll just keep it on and just connect the usb c cable so i've connected the usb c cable now moving on to the computer so this is the root directory of the transmitter it already has a folder which contains some audio but this is not where we have to put the bin file we have to put it in the root directory so i'm just going to take this is this the transmitter file yes you can see tx i'm just going to drag it and put it in the root directory and as soon as it transfers i think this device will also start up updating itself hopefully it should is the transfer done yes the transfer is done so i'm just going to unplug the usb c and hopefully it should start to update and you can see it is blinking red and green meaning that the transmitter device is also starting to upgrade if you go to the screen you can see after disconnecting connecting from the computer the receiver will start upgrading automatically and the screen will display updating and the transmitter needs to be powered on to start upgrading automatically the system status led will blink red and green alternately during the upgrading process meaning that this transmitter is upgrading itself and now it is again solid green so the upgrade on the transmitter is done and as this got upgraded on the receiver also we got a message that the update is successful so both the receiver and the mic that is the transmitter have upgraded let's now check the firmware if i go to the settings and if i scroll down to the version the touch screen is kind of a little finicky it takes some time to get used to but if i go to the version now let's click on the version there you go you can see we have the upgraded version for the receiver which is 4.3.8.31 earlier it was something around 4.2 now it is 4.3 let's see what the transmitter version is there you go for the transmitter also we have the latest version that is 4.3.8.31 so yeah this is how you quickly upgrade your firmware on your latest DJI Mic 2 systems in case if you have the only transmitter you just have to download the transmitter bin file if you have both receiver and transmitter you have to get both of those and if you have the two transmitter one receiver combo you have to do this for both the transmitters individually okay and that will you know do all the upgrades for your DJI Mic 2 system so i just wanted to quickly share this information about the latest firmware upgrade on the DJI Mic 2 and wanted to quickly do it live on video along with you guys so that even you guys can easily upgrade the firmware on your Mic 2 system Okay thanks for watching guys if you like this video give it a thumbs up let me know in the comments about what else do you want to know about the DJI Mic 2 system so that i can include that in the full review which is coming up very soon hope you have subscribed for that thanks for watching see you in the next one peace